Hey guys, welcome to another video. Thanks for joining today. Today I'm going to do an update, uh, a long-term review, if you will, on the Topo Spectre. I've got about 275 miles in these, so um, I've had good good uh, use out of them. Uh, I just ran 50 miles in them this past weekend at the Perpetual Motion 24-hour race. Uh, I should have gone longer and I would have continued running in these. They were still comfortable. But I just thought it's a good time to give an update. Um, if you look at the shoes, they still look perfect on the upper. Uh, 275 miles in, uh, they're still uh, perfect on the upper. The insole still feels good. They're still very comfortable around the heel. Uh, these do have the 35 millimeters stack height in the heel and 30 in the forefoot, so they have a 5 millimeter drop. They do have the uh, it's the Zip Foam EVA frame. It's their older Zip Foam that's a little firm. So, so these shoes do feel a little bit firm, even though they've got a lot of cushion. They do have a inner core of p backs which does give it some bounciness. Uh, you don't always feel feel the bounciness. Uh, I do some, but it is a fairly firm ride. But I just find them extremely comfortable, and they're very rockered. So you feel like you're moving a little quicker in them. So these I would I, I use them for long runs and long run up tempo type of runs. So the 50 mile race was perfect for them this past weekend. Um, the one negative I would say is that you could they could probably have a little bit more p backs in them to to feel the bounciness a little bit more. And uh, my understanding is in the Spectre twos that'll be coming out this in 2024 August uh, they're actually going to be full p back so they'll be a lot bouncier uh, we'll just see if they're stable enough at that point but uh, and the other complaint is that the outsole rubber is a bit thin uh, and you can see I've pretty well worn through it um, it's better on this shoe but I've, I've really damaged it uh, so that's that's kind of the limiting factor that's going to probably cause me to retire these shoes before too long I'm actually finding right now they're still real comfortable even with this little thin bit of rubber gone. I haven't gone into the midsole too much. And uh, I'll apply some shoe goo and I will definitely get uh, a few, a bit more mileage out of these. But uh, that, that would be the one thing. And as I understand the new Spectre 2s when they come out, they are going to make the rubber a little thicker. So that should help with the durability. But anyway, I have really enjoyed the shoes. I think they've been great. Uh, They've held up really well, other than that outsole rubber being a little thin. And I do heel strike some, so I do tend to wear through outsole rubber anyway. Um, but you'll see, even up in the forefoot, uh, I do have worn a little bit up here. But for the most part, you can still see the word topo on all the rubber. So the rubber has held up pretty well. Uh, and I'm, I'm kind of a... I heel strike some, but I'm, I'm very much a, mostly a midfoot striker, so I'm still hitting the front and I roll through it. And that rubber up there has held up perfectly well. It's just, just where I am really hard on rubber. Um, I think I scrape my heels a little bit. But anyway, um, the, the midsole in the middle that's not covered by rubber, of course, gets dirty and shows some wear, but even it's not even very torn up. These shoes have lasted extremely well. Um, Anyway, I'm very happy with them. I've enjoyed the shoes, the little stays on the tongue to keep it in place. Uh, they use these little loops. Uh, it has worked perfectly, uh, no issue at all. So I don't think you really need a gusseted tongue when the, the little stays work as well as they do. Anyway, that's my thoughts on the Topo Spectre at 275 miles. Um, if you enjoyed the video, please consider giving it a thumbs up, a like, hitting the like button. If you're interested in any more of my content, please consider subscribing to my channel. And other than that, I hope you're having a wonderful day. And keep moving!